Alright guys, I'm going to show you how to get the latest version of iExtreme firmware or LT Plus or whatever even comes out in the future. This way of doing it um, pretty much will always work. So the first thing you want to do is go to an IRC, Fnet, um, Fnet IRC, and it's basically a chat room. Um, so what I do is I go to this link right here, x360usb.com slash irc.html. There might be easier ways of going around this or even programs you can use to log into IRCs, but I like to do it this way just because it's really, really simple. I click on New Interface, um, and I put in a nickname. And then the channel you want to go to is pound C4E. All you do is click connect and bam, you have it all up here. So now you're in this chat room with all of these people. Um, and the first thing you want to look out for is if there's any C4 Evo Speaks updates right here. And that's what it'd be. Now this is kind of old, so you don't have to really worry about that. But here's LTV 3.0 and Jungle Flasher. And this is always going to be up to date. So this is the newest Jungle Flasher and this is the newest LT. Um, firmware pack and uh, whenever new LTs come out or if if C4 ever comes out with a whole entirely new firmware system it's gonna be here on his uh, on his chat room uh, so you go ahead and just click on this link and it'll get you to the download link and um, and of course on like the team executor forums and stuff you can't you're not really allowed to post download links so uh, they they're allowing you to put it here um, and it's really easy to get to but not everyone really understands how to get to it so this this video hopefully will help it for you guys you can click on go ahead and click on download and some pop-up came up naturally and, um, and you can see down here it's downloading so it's a dot RAR file which means that it's WinRAR WinRAR, of course, uh, you, you need to have the WinRAR, the, uh, the the thing to extract it, to extract the files. That's also a free download. Um, if you just Google WinRAR, honestly, you should be able to, yeah, see, you should be able to go through WinRAR's website, download and support. Um, and, and it's not free software, but you're allowed to have a free download, and then they'll just keep on reminding you, hey, this is some free software, go ahead and pay for it. But I've been been getting that pop-up for like three years now, so they have never forced me to stop using it. Um, so you don't have to really worry about that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just let this keep on downloading. In the meantime, a cool website for you to maybe check out if you don't know it is C4 Eva Speaks. Uh, if you can see, you can see uh, if you know what uh, drive you have, you can see what the latest firmware is for you. So, for example, if you had a Hitachi that's not a 78 or 79, you can see that the latest one is LT uh, 2.0, and, and it's a really cool uh, graph because it really includes everything that you need to know like here's the latest AVGX, Jungle Flasher, Xbox Backup Creator things like that so for example I have a Samsung and uh, so here it'll tell me that 2.01 is the latest one that's for me and you can also learn things like why there's no V3.0 for Samsung or the Hitachi uh, so it's a really cool website and of course anything that's the newest things uh, in terms of dashboards and things like that, they'll they'll be here, um, and uh, because this is like the website that compiles everything that C4 Eva says in in the uh, IRC, and you can see that like he says, well that's a smiley face, but you know he can see you can see what people have asked him and what he's responded to, and these are official responses. So now that this is done. We can go ahead and open it. And you see, it even says it's not a free software. After a 40 day trial period, you must either buy a license or remove it. Well, I've just closed that every time, and, and it's been no problem. So, here you're going to have your stock firmware, your uh, LT firmware, and 
and this is the uh, 0800 to make uh, rips of your original copies so you can go ahead and extract that too like I put on desktop and then I'll just put a new folder and I'll have it as like LT 3.0 I already have this folder on my on my uh, on my computer I, I moved it so I could go ahead and show you the installation and uh, there it should be done by now here it is hmm that's weird that's really weird let's try that again Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. So, yeah. Alright, so now it should be done. I don't know what happened that first time. But, okay, here we go. So, here's all the stock firmware and the normal firmware and things like that. And, uh, that's really all there is to it. Uh, and using this IRC method, you can get always the latest up to date um, LT firmware and things like that there's no um there, uh, there this this is the method to do it to download your lt firmware your jungle flash or anything else that you need um so i hope this helped you guys and uh, if it did please push the like button and if you have any questions leave them in the comments and i'll get back to you and thank you very much for watching the video take care